Okay, so hopefully we'll make some headway with year three this time. When we left off, what happened last time? Last time we got on the boat and one year passed as it does in Grim Fandango. And suddenly we're the captain now. <laughs> Oh dear. Can I examine the case? Ensign Arnold was just a kid. That's a bit grim. They've all been uh what's the term they use here? Sprouted. Yog, hey, how are you doing? Brett with a knife, glad to see you. Oh, wait. Oh, Glorious. Yeah, we want to check your bags. Don't worry, Captain. We're safe in here. Okay, let's just. So I'm definitely ca man is definitely the captain. Oh, okay. <laughs> Look at Gladys. She seems quite excited. It's hard to totally panic when you're wearing that little sailor suit. <laughs> no, it's not. Gladys, do something. Okay. <laughs> Should have known. Okay, so we're definitely uh, in this room then. Opening the door doesn't seem to be an option. Okay, so what do we have here? Man, this just straight off the bat. Okay, so those are. That's a button. Those are. Controls of some sort. That here is the engine, I assume. Looks like an engine. I think the best way to use this engine would be the controls over there, as opposed to the hands on method. Uh, okay, right. <clears throat> There's another button. It's the same type of button. Oh. Okay. So what do the buttons do then? Let's figure it out. Anchor. Does the other one do the same? Hmm. Can't engage the button when I'm taking a look at the anchor. But I looks like the anchor's down. Aha, uh -huh, okay, right, so that's probably what the button does then. And does it Yeah, okay. Oh that much is clear at least. Well, let's get the anchors up. Why not? Okay, what else do we have? What do the controls do? Game is a bit quiet. Let me just increase. I haven't changed it since last time, but... Not, not much happening still. That should be a bit better. The anchors are up, aren't they? Okay, what about reverse? So definitely not reverse.
Oh, are we moving? Oh, not much. <laughs> Ah, okay. So, unless I'm wrong, the fact that we can shift the ship from left to right or from port to starboard, as it were, is gonna have to do with whatever we have to do in this room. Yeah, that's. I think that's all we can do with these controls. Did I lower the game volume and... Yeah, I did a bit. In the actual post audio settings I did a bit. So this should be a bit better now. Yeah. Okay. Alright, so that's definitely all that the ship does. I know of the other options we have. Does Glottis change his dialogue Gladys, in any way? Do something. Okay. <laughs> yeah, that's that's endearing, but it's not a very helpful guy. Uh, okay, um let's try with anchors down. Actually can I Oh sure. Now I find an actual rusty anchor. <laughs> it says inspected by number thirty six? He's doing his best. <laughs> I know. <laughs> Can't reach. Can't reach. Can't reach. Do we have anything in inventory? Our trusty side. So it seems I missed the whole casino bit last week. How did you like that part? Right, so um Rubakava I think compared that's the town's name, yeah? Uh compared to the first year much more convoluted. Uh, I spent once one whole stream, well, about three hours or so, just exploring stuff, and I was very sleepy. <laughs> and and one more stream, finishing finishing it up, essentially. And there was this one puzzle with printing um, a ticket stub that I think I cheesed it a bit. Uh, I knew what one number was, I knew I needed a day of the week, and, and I had no idea what the other number was. So I looked it up later. It turns out that um, it does make sense if you pay very special attention to the conversation, only if you get into that office uh, in the casino. Um, the, the other number is the week that he proposed and the blimp is in there in the picture so that bit i totally lucked out on it and it just worked out because I, I just started trying all the all the combinations and started from one and it was actually two so it worked out nicely <laughs> uh, but it was interesting to do even though i don't think i would have gotten that it would have taken me more time obviously but it worked out, so I'm hoping not to get that stuck in this bed. And I'm, I, I don't miss Rubakawa. I gotta be honest. My scythe. I like to keep it next to where my heart used to be. Used to be okay. So can we use the side on the anchor, maybe to reach it? My scythe. I like to keep it next to where my heart used to be. No. Uh, something about getting an old picture from the cat races. Yeah, the thing was, you you get pictures from uh, of cats from the races to check out uh, the photo finishes, and. You need the photo of Olivia cheating, quote unquote, um, and it turns out that 
there's a photo of a, of a photo finish cat race in the, in the tattoo artist's album. So, the, the photographer girl, I forget her, Lola. La, Lola, I think. You, it turns out that she hid the actual photo that you need in the ticket stub with, with the photo finishes. Yeah. And that bit, I think, was a bit too much. It wasn't that much in retrospect. It makes sense. But I did luck out on that ticket stub. Um, I'm not sure how long it would have taken me otherwise. Okay, so let's try, try to focus on this. So I can try to reach for the anchor, obviously. Did something special happen with the... Emily Dickinson inspired poetry skeleton lady in the last room? No. Uh, nothing special, I think. She's probably still there in the club. Can we try to reach for this one? Yeah, she's... Uh, 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 shame, you say, yeah. I think I would have liked to see more of her as well. She, she seemed fun. Same deal. Okay. Um, let's try to lower the anchors, I guess. Can I press the button? Yeah, okay. It's sort of annoying that you're going for the button and it crosses over into that screen. You have to be very slow. Okay, huzzah. What now? <laughs> they were down to begin with, weren't they? <laughs> no, no. Put it down, Manny. Okay, let's try the controls. Yeah, you can see the anchors down there. Okay, nothing special. Does the ship still make that tilt? It does. Oh, look at... Look at how long those chains are. Okay, let's um, let's try with um, let's try with one anchor now. No, same, really. Yeah, it still does the same movement. That doesn't change it. Okay. Uh, yeah, so it's gonna be about some sort of combination of anchors down, anchors up. Doing something with the side to reach for them. Why would you want to reach for them, though? 
<laughs> You're 55. Uh, I hope I'm saying that right. Uh, hiya, thank you for following. I saw you followed a couple of days ago. Yeah, you definitely want to do something with them at some point to reach for them with the side. He tries but doesn't. We haven't. Oh. Are they jumbled together? Wait, what happens if you... If you retract it now. Yeah, they are. They're stuck together. Ah, yeah, because of... Right. Because of the way the ship tilts. And how long the chains are. When we were tilted to one side, lowered one. Aha, uh -huh, I see. Okay. So can we reach for it now? Yeah, I'm counting that as progress. <laughs> the animation looks about the same. Well, there you go. Uh, thanks, Manny. Okay, so the anchors are now tied around the boat. Does that help? Not really. The tech game, he says he doesn't want to mess up his blade only to pull a heavy rusty anchor <laughs> with it. <laughs> <laughs> Counterintuitive, Manny. Yeah. When the time is right, Manny's not afraid to put that size out. Okay, so we still do the same movement, nothing really changes. Wait, what happens if I try to retract? So, um, the the port anchor, the left one, left is port, yay. Um, <laughs> the port one is now stuck to the starboard. So what happens if I try to retract it? Because it's down, right? Technically speaking, it's extended. Gladys, cover your ears. Ooh, <laughs> that can't be good. <laughs> I think we may have broken the boat. What was that? The dotted line, buddy. Okay. Now there is a a huge gash in the hull. Are we taking on water? I don't think so. Can't reach. Okay, so nothing other than tearing up the hole pretty good. Can't reach. If I mess with these anchors anymore, we might go down with the ship. That may yet still happen. I have <laughs> my sight. I like to keep it next to where my heart used to be. Uh, yeah. That line never gets old, but it's not helpful. Gladys, anything to say, buddy? Gladys, do something. Okay. First try. 
Yeah, you've played. You remember this year well. What about the controls? Nothing there. Do we still? That's fairly unimpressive. Okay. Oh! <laughs> the engines are in that part. <laughs> That's cute. Oh, sinking? Yeah. Uh, I remember it taking me way longer than it's taken you. To do this bit, you mean? I think this one was... This one was way easier than than some of the stuff in, in Rubacal. Uh, th there's just a couple of things in that room you can do and... I just try it out combinations. <laughs> That's all. Choking. Mira, snap out of it, sailor. Easy for you to say. You don't have lungs. Hey, you live without your heart once, so you can live without air for a little while. That's infallible Let's logic. Like figure out what we're gonna do. So we're at the bottom of the ocean. That's our ship in the background. Well, the most horrible monsters of all, the fearsome murky demons of the deep, will swallow you whole the instant you leave this pool of light. Heed my warning, or take one step forward and learn for yourself. All right, all right, I believe you. Just quit it with the creepy spirit of the land voice, huh? So stay in the light? Is that what he wants to say? <laughs> What? Hey, Shipton. I think my fondest memories of this game are from year three. Ooh. Who's that? You all right? Oh no. The spirit of the land. He just Danny. passed us by. Not of the sea. Hang in there, man. Might not have been a sea monster, but it was pretty spooky. There's just a guy walking at the bottom of the ocean, <laughs> and he just passed us by. Okay, so we definitely stay in the light. Who? Is that the same? Yeah, that's the same guy walking in the background in there. And there's something shining over there as well. Okay, so we can't leave the circle of light. Mm-hmm. Goddess? You all right? I'm a spirit of the land, Manny. Not of the sea. Hang in there, Manu. So not helpful. Anything in the inventory? I'm assuming that's not gonna be helpful right now. No, that's all. You can hear a whale song in the background. Huh. And you do hear uh, some water effects, even though there's obviously no graphical water effects. You do hear some. There's that guy again. What is he... Definitely go over there first chance I get, but there's a lot of dark water between here and there. Okay, so we want to go for the light bed, and, but we can't leave our circle of light.
No. Uh. Incidentally, I did. Uh, when I was looking at that that puzzle from Rubicava, I did read about. Let me just save because I just remembered. I did read about there potentially being a, a bug in year three that may get you stuck. But apparently, as long as you save often enough, um, it shouldn't really be a problem. So let's let's say year three or one. I'm gonna try to be helpful with the save names. <laughs> And it's not the bug that's in the remastered version, because apparently there's another bug that's in the remastered version. Uh... Oh! Let's, let's try to talk to this guy, maybe that's... Amigo! Huh? Who? Oh, jeez, another shipwreck! You see? That's why I never travel by boat. We've had a little accident. Think you could help us out? Depends on what kind of help you're looking for. Okay, so he has a he has a light? Could we borrow that light for a second? Sorry, I'm kind of attached to it. Haha. <laughs> -ha. See what he did there? Mm -hmm. Could you take us to the Pearl? Pearl? Ah, you don't believe those old stories, do you? You think somewhere in this ocean there's a gigantic pearl that shines so brightly it can be seen from passing ships? And that sometimes sailors so allured by its luster actually fling themselves overboard to dive for it? And are never heard from again? Yeah, and I think it's right over. Blah! Is that thing the pearl? In this ocean for years, I ain't never seen it. What if? What if is that? What if that's the pearl? No, really, the pearl is right over there. For a shadow, you hmm? poor sucker. That's the moon. Tell me you didn't come all this way out here to pearl dive the moon. That's the moon. <laughs> that's not the moon. What are you doing down here? Trying to get out of the land of the dead, same as everybody else. Mm -hmm. So he's doing the journey as well. Why are you walking instead of taking a ship? Got sick of waiting around Rubicava for a boat. He was also in Rubicava. Time this way. Why didn't I think of that? <laughs> yeah, we should have just started walking at the bottom of the ocean because apparently we can do that. Yeah, we are a skeleton, of course we can do that. Why didn't we just... Okay. How do you know where you're going? See That's the slow moon. <laughs> I just keep it on my right. That way I know I'm heading in a straight line. But... Oldest trick in the book. Wait. Did he just say what I think he said? First, if that is the moon, keeping the moon from his perspective makes sense, from his point of view. Uh, <laughs> that's obviously not the moon. So, if if it's if it's a stationary object at the bottom of the ocean or somewhere in the ocean, and he's always been keeping it to the left, did he say? Does that mean... Is that why he's, he was walking around in a circle? That's brilliant. That's exactly the kind of writing I would, I would expect from, from a LucasArts adventure game. That's, that's just... I love it. you send for help? Oh, sure. I promise to call for help at the next phone booth I walk by.
Hmm. Is everything okay with your eyebrows? Them is barnacles, genius. I don't oh, he's been down there for a while now. So they tend to pile up. I don't mind though, they're the only company I got. Yeah. <laughs> Ain't you boys? Hmm. Shouldn't you have hit yeah. by land by now? But no, because he's been walking in the circle. <laughs> already done it in a boat a boat don't talk to me about boats doesn't like boats what's the problem with boats we had such a nice boat why is everybody always talking about boats you got a perfectly good pair of legs why not use them I say true but oh let me guess. That would make sense. You died in a boat wreck. A boat wreck would have been better than what happened to us. Led off course by bad equipment, lost for weeks, no food, no shelter from the sun. Mm -hmm. We started throwing the dead overboard. But then the sharks began following the boat. Oh. What happened in the end? What happened was I learned three valuable lessons. Stay away from boats. Mm -hmm. When it comes to navigation, trust only the moon and the stars. And when there's only two of you left, never, ever go to sleep. Uh, 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 uh okay. <laughs> How long have you been down here? Well, let me put it this way. I wasn't always this color. <laughs> How have you kept that light going all these years? Well, I found this coral, this glow-in-the-dark coral. Damnedest thing. Mm -hmm. Glows like a lightning bug and never seems to wear out. I had some of that once. Made a nice grappling hook. I don't think you had what I got, because I don't think you've been to the place where I got it. Where'd you, Where'd get, you get it? Edge of the world, boy. That's the only place it grows. Could we tag along? Yeah, I'm not sure we want to tag along if he keeps if he keeps going in circle. Um, I'd rather not tag along. So is that it? Well, I don't want to break your stride there. Okay, see you around. Watch out for sea monsters. Who? These guys? Uh <laughs> Yeah. Oh, they don't mess with old Chipito. I'm too bright for him. <laughs> too bright for him. This little light of mine, I'm gonna let it shine. This little light of mine. Wait, is I'm that all we can do? Shine. What? Hey, Leo. What? What's? What? What? What am I supposed to do with this? Follow me. I wanted to Where talk to him again. Me? The moon. <laughs> what? 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 <laughs> okay. Is that the pearl? Ooh I knew I'd find her someday. I'm rich, 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 rich. Shh. Something's happening. Benny, what's going on? The heck? Release the Kraken, yeah. <laughs> oh, are those his eyes? Oh, those are his eyes in there. Look at them. Mm. So, what do we do? Hey, hands off! Okay, he doesn't Nothing let me take it anymore. Personal bubble, but I'll bet that light is what's attracting the octopus. Is it? So, let's get rid of it. How do I get rid of it? Go down there and talk demon talk to that octopus. Heck no! I'm scared! <laughs> I'm staying up here with Glottis you! Glottis is not that kind of demon. 
Aww. <laughs> okay. Any anywhere else we can go? Wait, are they... They're tagging along. They're definitely tagging along, yeah. Yeah, and the octopus is following, yeah. Hmm. What's that? Oh. Those don't look friendly. I want to stay away from them. Please. I'm walking back this way. Can I walk? Uh. Oh, I want to walk around it. No? Okay. What about trying to stay away from them? Wait. Let me just... <laughs> Safe again. I'm not gonna resort to loading unless you really have to. But so let's walk. Oh, I just walked past them. Wait, it's automated now. Hey, Leo. Uh huh. Uh huh. Uh huh. Okay. So the point was to get him stuck in there. Oh, listen to the audio. Much more modulated now. Yeah. Ooh. <laughs> Gosh, that's... That's one way to get it going. Oh, the edge, literally. We're at the edge of the world. Hmm. Manny? Don't ask Carnal, because I don't know. I was going to it, okay. Well, at least they're hanging a lampshade on it. I'm here it's turtles and elephants all the way down, yeah. <laughs> See any hint of that octopus swimming around here? No, but I can smell him. Oh, so he's around? Mm -hmm. Nothing but dark water is that direction. So I can't walk away. Ah, okay, right, so, uh, the... Th that looks like a conveyor belt, and th the bug I read about is related to a conveyor belt. So, the advice was, in order to avoid the game-breaking bug, just don't mess with the conveyor belt, unless you really have to. So, I'm not gonna mess with it, unless I really have to. This was... There were spoiler tags, and I tried not to open them, but... If I have to, I will load up that walkthrough and see what it's what, what it's about. Octopus comes back while you're gone. Poke him in the eye and steal his sub. <laughs> Stupid octopus. I've heard about that bug, but never personally experienced it, so I don't know how often it happens. Well, hopefully it, uh, it won't happen then. Um, yeah, I, some people seem to be experiencing it and it seems to be related to the way uh, it has something to do with processor speed if I read that correctly and since I'm I'm not playing this directly on the OS technically speaking I'm residual VM is doing the the emulation well, it's not really emulation, it's still addressing the hardware directly, so we'll see. 
So that's an elevator. Whoa, where am I? Okay, here I am. Ah, uh, if you go into the elevator, it engages. Well, yeah, it's like the one in Rubacaba. Okay, let's go up. Let's go up. Yeah, same deal at the bottom. Alright, so a couple of doors. Mm, this door's locked. No, not here then. Over there. Hmm, interesting, interesting designs. Ooh. There's a bucket. It's empty. Okay. There's uh, something else. Oh, it's an ashtray. So we have the lit cigarette on us. As we always do, of course. Of course. So there's the ashtray. There's the bucket. Anything else? Doors in here. Oh, oh, oh. is that my chi? Yeah. Manny, what are you doing here? I wanted to see how your trip was going, Angel. I am your travel agent, you know. Mm -hmm. By the way, thanks for that bottle of champagne you sent me. It really hit the spot. You were headed for a trap. Uh, yeah. <laughs> warn you. Domino was using me like bait. I didn't want you to end up a prisoner here like me. Prisoner? Where's your cell? Or are you just sharing a bunk with the warden? If that's what you think of me, uh, don't be that way, Manny. Because this is where he belongs. Here, working for me. I knew you'd come around eventually. Right or wrong, Manuel Calavera is always with the winning team, right, Manny? That's why you're here now. I'm getting off this rock, and I'm taking all of these people with me. <laughs> Manny, there's no way off this island. I'm afraid you're stuck here in my little executive training program. See, I need you to take my place here, kid. I've got to get back to the city where the action is. Hmm. Sorry, what? Manny, but I had to come in. My skin was getting all pruney. Him, I don't need. <laughs> I'm gonna grind you to powder for that, Gaudon. Nah, Gaudon is fine. Now, let me just show you your new office. Oof. Guys, Can't relax. I'm sure Gladys is perfectly fine. There's no way we just lost Gladys. So where are we? <laughs> no drawers. That's a desk, but no drawers. Okay, and there are two cherub angels, whatever they are. Hola, angelitos. Angelitos. I'll bite you, I swear to God! Please don't bite anyone else, Pugsy. That's why they put us in the cage in the first place. Okay. My name is Manny Calavera. What's yours? Mr. Hurley told us about you. You're the one who tricked Meche. Poor Meche. Why do you want to bite me? You're the mean new boss. Mr. Hurley said you were meaner than him. He said you had a bone saw. Ooh. I didn't trick anybody. Mr. Hurley said he was supposed to take care of Meche, but you stole her case from him. Is that true? That's... well... <laughs> Meche's my friend. You can ask her. She talked about you before. Every time she says your name, she looks so sad. I don't know what you did to her, but you're gonna be sorry! Yeah, it's complicated, kids. It's not that simple. <laughs> Let me see if I can explain this whole thing to you. You see... I had this job selling travel packages to immigrant souls. Yeah, it's gonna go down well. I sold enough of them, I got to leave the land of the dead. Now I was in a slump and I really needed a fat commission, so you're a bad man. 
Go away, Batman. Yeah, go away. This conversation is not really going well. What are you two doing in this cage? Making light bulbs. Look, we're working what? as hard as we can. Why don't you leave us alone? They're making light bulbs. Listen, children, I'm here to help. There's really not much more room in here. Your hands are too big to make light bulbs. <laughs> I'm so confused. My hands are not too big to make light bulbs. Then why don't you help? Wait, is this... Why are we talking about light, light bulbs? I'm in the Maritime Union. We can't do factories. Yes. I don't know what those words mean. <laughs> it means he doesn't want to help us because he's mean. That's not true. I just don't have any of those little tiny tools, that's all. Here, take my hammer. <laughs> oh, we're making a light, so... <sighs> okay, well, makes sense. Wait, did he just okay. throw something at me? So mean. Yeah. It's a... It's a something. This is the tiniest little hammer I've ever seen. Yeah, so he did throw his, his hammer. Can I do something with it? Anything? I don't really want to do that. No. Let's put it away then. Oh yeah, they're working on the coral. Yeah, they're chopping up little pieces of coral and making quote-unquote light bulbs. I see. Okay. Hola, angelitos. Hello, Mr. Mean Boss Guy. Yeah, now I need to find the tiniest ever name. <laughs> okay, so it's the same dialogue. Uh, I mean, I don't see a okay, point to being rude to them. So mean. Unless it gives me something else at some point. Okay, so if the door's not closed, we're not restricted to this area. We can go back there. Ah, so that's the... Ah, okay. That's the door that was locked. That's the same area. Oh, Meche is in here. Oh, look, it's my prince. Charming. Are you back here just to insult me some more, or do you just want some ice for your head? <laughs> okay. No, don't. Don't smoke. Let's talk to her. I'm a bit confused about the ashtray being so mobile. Is it so she can sit in there, put it near her, and then put it away when she wants to sit up so the whole thing doesn't take up much space? Is that it? And why are you looking at the ashtray? Look at her. Oh, that's a bit fiddly. Okay. Come on, we're getting out of here. Trying to steal my commission from Domino again. Manny, don't you ever give up? I'm not after any commission. I just want to get us both out of here. Then why don't you just ask your boss for the day off? I think we need to talk. Start talking. You're the salesman. Mm hmm. Can't believe you think he's my boss. He's my arch enemy. I think he's your boss. You think he's my boyfriend. We don't seem to have a good foundation of trust in our relationship. None of this is right. <laughs> okay, let's be. I have a lot of explaining to do. Save your breath. Domino's explained it all to me already. Okay, let's try to apologize. I'm sorry I implied he was your boyfriend. I do trust you. Well, I'm not sure I trust you about that. 
But I'll tell you one thing that would convince me. Name it. Give me your gun. We, we don't have a gun. We've never had a gun. What? What makes you think I have a gun? You work for the most heavily armed organization in the land of the dead. Don't try to tell me they didn't issue you a gun. What? 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 I don't work for the most heavily armed organization anywhere. You know, you're right. There are those rumors of that revolutionary army that's been stockpiling weapons. Oh wait. wait. <laughs> yeah, that's that's true. <laughs> Why don't you come back? But we don't have a gun. That's straight with me, okay? Wait, that didn't go that well. Hey, about that gun. Ready to hand over your heater? I would if I had one. Right. So we need a gun. They didn't issue me a gun. What are you on probation? I'm not buying this, Manuel. Manny. She doesn't why believe us. Come back when you're willing to deal straight with me, okay? Are we actually going to have to find a gun so she can talk to us? <laughs> that's that's really hey, annoying. That gun. Ready to hand over your Yeah. Leader? I would if I had one. We can't progress right. the dialogue without without a gun, I guess. Yeah, look at the options. Yeah, I don't want to fight. I think we're at a good point right now. <laughs> I'm gonna go see about getting us a boat. Ooh, remember to get a fast one so we can water ski, all right? She's not gonna let it go. It's empty. Our type of hey, business doesn't produce gun. a lot of paperwork. Uh, Ready to hand over your Ah, uh -huh, okay. Bit of a crossover. I had one. Right. Yeah, definitely the same bit of dialogue. I'm gonna go see about getting us a boat. Ooh, remember okay, okay, you don't need to repeat that. That's a bit hurtful. Ow! Oh, my stockings! They're ruined! And this was my best hair! Uh huh. One nice thing on this cruel island. I'm not sure what happened. So when you engage the the ashtray, Manny moves it over so he can Wait, does the ashtray move only so that that can happen? Because I don't... I still don't see a good reason for that ashtray to be like this. <laughs> Shepard, yes. It does move so that can happen. Wait, did she throw it away in the bucket? Good enough for me. What is... Oh, uh, the, um, the speed at which you're working. That's nice, Manny, but you're not my boss, so really I couldn't care less. Good. Excellent. Carry on. The I only steal ashtrays from bars. So we got the little hammer, the scythe, and... So are those... Are those the stockings we got then? Because... She she took them off and she threw them in the bucket in the bucket, and then we retrieved them from the bucket. Sir, do you have an appointment? I'm going in there to tell Domino my demands. I don't think you fully understand the chain of command around here. Pugsy and Bibi work for you. You and I work for Domino, who works for Hector Le Mans, crime boss of El Maro. Well, I think it's time for a little corporate El Maro. Is he listening to music? Those are on ear headphones and he doesn't have any ears. Over the ear rather, yeah. Domino. Domino! Oh. Taking your first coffee break already, Calavera? <laughs> we got a score to settle this thing. You know. How did we end up working for that? Killed my 
Ah, so Manny thinks Gladys is dead. I'm sure he's not. There, there's no way he's gonna pop out of somewhere at some point. You can use a demon as a driver. Let him carry your messages. Let him serve you food. But you can't ever start thinking of them as friends. It's just not natural. He's racist as well. That's great. What are you doing out here on the edge of the world? Oh, I know. I ask myself that every day. But I'm going to train you, Manny, to take my place here running this two-bit light bulb factory. Hmm. Why don't you just sprout me like you tried a Puerto Zapato? That wasn't me. That was Hector. He's so unimaginative. Just wants to tie up the loose ends, you know? Uh huh. But I believe, however, that you can be rehabilitated through honest work. Uh. What makes you think I'm gonna work for you? Well, there's not much to do on this island if you don't work, take it from me. And think about it, once I'm gone, it will be just you and Meche alone on this deserted island. Yeah, that's an interesting prospect. Don't tell me that prospect doesn't appeal to you. <laughs> Jinx. Hector set up a secret hideout to make light bulbs? Oh no, that's just a side benefit. The real purpose is to have a place we can lock up all those old clients of mine. Can't have good people wandering loose in the land of the dead, telling everybody how we stole their double end tickets, now can we? Mm hmm, mm hmm. You stole all these people's tickets? Okay, how much of this haven't you figured out, Calavera? Paul would route all the good clients to me after he switched over their tickets to a secret holding fund. Okay. I'd cover up the paper trail. Yeah. And we'd make sure that the pigeon jumped overboard at the pearl. Ah, oh, all those people, right. Okay, that makes sense. I knew it. You were getting all the good clients. I handled them all, except for Mercedes, who you hijacked for me in that ridiculous hot rod. Which <laughs> I saw, by the way. Hey, that's a great car. I tell you, Manny, hot rods like that just don't look safe to me. That's the point, I think. So it wasn't my fault Mecha didn't get a ticket. You stole it. Well, it's your fault she ended up in the forest instead of coming here right away. But I fixed that. Hmm. I'm taking Meche out of this dungeon. Manny, before I found her, she spent a year out there in a petrified forest alone because of you. By comparison, Jeez. I'd say I'm keeping her pretty comfortable here in my uh, dungeon, wouldn't you say? I hate to agree with this guy, but... One ticket for you, one for Hector. How many more do you need? Oh, Manny. We never touch the product ourselves. We sell a ticket to unfortunate souls, unable to lead moral lives because of the crippling amount of cash they were born into. That's an interesting point of view. But you could just take the tickets and leave today. We found a way to make the land of the dead livable. Why would we want to leave? Hmm. <laughs> I don't plan to be on this island for very long. Manny, I have all the guns. I have all the transportation. And I have all the brains. What are you gonna do? Um, well, whatever we can, I assume. Hmm. How can you keep little children in a cage? So that's all Trust exposition, me, it's is it? Easier than keeping big kids in a cage. Nice island you got here. Yeah, the previous owners didn't know what they had here. Let us pick it up for a song. They scooped out all the coral they could reach with their crane and then abandoned the plant. But we knew we had what it would take to go the extra distance to the big reef. Oh, geez. Are you about to lecture me about the winning attitude again? No. Slave labor, Manny. That's the real ticket to success. Of course it is. Well, 
I gotta get back to trying to this escape. guy. <laughs> hey, you do that, kid. Knock yourself out. I've got nothing to say to him. Well, yeah, okay, so we knew most of that, but he cleared up some <clears throat> details. So right now we're, I'm going to say looking for a gun, because uh, long term I have no idea. <laughs> By the way, if you guys hear cats fighting at any point, it's not your imagination. Our youngest uh, Tomcat is uh, a teenager right now and he's fighting with with. Uh, one of the older cats. He's playing, but she's not taking it very well. She is a bit. She's still not used to him. <laughs> Completely. Getting in the elevator really should be simpler. Okay, so gun. Uh, no guns lying about. Nothing but dark water is that direction. Not here. So we we checked out that bit. That's where the conveyor boat is. Okay, let me get away from the conveyor ba boat screen and save just to make sure. There's gotta be more. Do, is this way an option? It doesn't seem to be. Hmm. Oh. Okay. Oh, is that... That's our favorite guy. Walking about in circles guy. What about these guys? Yeah, he, he took all the guys, all the people. Was Terry one of the worker bees? Did we give him the the, the manifesto? Yeah, that's right. Ah, so the workers manifesto. <laughs> yeah, that would that would work nicely here. Okay, so let's talk to him then. His eyebrows? Oh, the barnacles must be gone. Well, you really weren't standing in a very safe place. Well, neither are you right now, Ogo. Is that a threat? Relax, we're busting out of here soon. We, we are done traveling together. I work solo, my friend, and I walk alone. Mm hmm. That tool looks a little overpowered for you. Yeah, shaking him really intensely. Nothing overpowers Chapito. If you say so. <laughs> Look at him. Nice drill. Drill? This here is a cordless high speed reciprocating chisel. And look, it's a bust off. They usually don't give these to the new guys. A bust off? Is that a brand name? How'd you get a bust off? Connected, plugged in, and I had some booty to trade. Trade's the name of the game out here in the Big Reef. Booty? Where'd you get booty? It's all over the ocean floor. Jewelry, precious coins. You people and your fancy boats <laughs> never know about it. <laughs> He's not fond of boats. Stop and look. 
Give me some booty and I'll buy our way out of here. I traded it all for this beauty. You traded jewelry and precious coins for a power tool? It's a bust all. Can't argue there. So he's really into trading. Well, you came to the right place, Sonny. What you be need? A gun. Yeah, let's go for a gun. Ooh, that's gonna cost some. What do you got on you? My scythe, my turtleneck. S some blue green algae. I think it's some form of blue green algae. Ah, oh, don't worry, you get used to it. <laughs> when you got something worth trading, come see old Chapito. You do your right. But wait, that's not. The dialogue is lying, isn't it? We have other stuff. If we if we're gonna mention the side. Wait, it can't be that simple. Let's try to give him something. I'm assume I'm assuming Manny's not gonna give him the side, but I wanna try anyway. Okay, so, all right, that's a good excuse. So, not the side. Is that yeah? That's the hammer. Have you ever seen an authentic little chipper? A little chipper? No, I haven't. But I sure. I'm gonna assume he made up the name. See, a little chipper. You're okay. -da Did he give us the the big drill? Yeah. So see, he must have really hated using it. I'm assuming that that's why he gave it to us because it's it's not shaking him like crazy. save I'm sorry if that gets annoying but I want to save as, as much as possible let's try giving him something else no you don't want no inventory so we got this what if we give him the stocking check out the hosiery These are real silk. Where'd you find them? I've been wearing them the whole time. <laughs> Cute. Well then, here's your new best friend. Ah, my first Frautella gun. You give us a gun. No. Hey, bullets are hard to get. Well, we don't need the bullets. We just want to give it to, to Meche, right? Gonna see Miss Do we have anything else to give him? So we need the gun, and uh, we, we took the bus doll from him, that's the side, okay, so that's, put it away Manny, anything else to talk about? <laughs> the voice acting, again, is great. I already asked him about this. Okay, let's go give the gun to Meshi. Oh, Is it my imagination or does this already feel a bit quicker than Rubakava? It took me hours to get anything done in there. Okay. Oh. 
it's really not much use without bullets. Not the ashtray, Manny. a relationship without trust true a relationship without trust is about as empty as a gun without bullets guess you didn't realize a smart girl always keeps an extra round in her hat for man what is she doing come on let's go Mitchie, you don't know what you i know exactly what i'm doing now move would you just listen to my escape plan first <laughs> paradise kid you're letting us go right now or your boy friday here gets it well i hate to see you go man she got him friday <laughs> made up her mind i'm serious i'll shoot him fine he really doesn't work for me anyway <laughs> but i thought he... i'll shoot you then no you won't you oh she realizes me. now I'm not, I'm not oh. taking that out of me keeping me a prisoner here i'm gonna crack you open like a fake bing bong i'm gonna <sighs> kids all right <laughs> she's a firecracker but a night in the cooler usually dampens her fuse Usually, how often do you put her wherever you put her in the cooler? All right, so going off screen just gives us a, a wider view of the office. I'm gonna assume there's nothing to talk about. Domino, or is there? Hey, sport. How's the uh, escape going? <laughs> what did you do with her? I thought she needed a little uh, time out, that's all. Well, I gotta get back to trying to escape. <laughs> hey, you do that, kid. Knock yourself out. Hmm. Okay, so where did he put her? She's not in here. Wait, that wasn't. I'm getting angry. Oh, there, there was a safe behind there. Is that a safe? What is it? I promise I won't pull guns on anyone anymore. She's in there. This isn't funny. I agree. Yeah. I'm in here. Hug the oh, I can control the. I'm gonna, at some point, need I'm to figure out a combination of some you. sort. Oh wait, there's... Open this door. The handle as well? Baby. I guess I didn't enter the right combination. Aha, uh -huh. okay. It's me, Meche! Ooh, I bet I could pick Baby. that. If only I hadn't lost my union card in that poker game. All right, we used the card. Mm -hmm. I'm warning you, Domino. Can I do anything special with it? Oh, no, I'm not really. You, we need we need pointers for this. And we've been here, definitely, yeah. Okay, so let's try at this point to go and mess with the conveyor belt. See if there's anything to do in there. And again, getting in this elevator, man. Look, I'm stuck again. Manny goes behind the elevator and you can't see him through the door and you you have to be slow and pointed that way. And I'm still not in there, come on. Look, this is ah okay. Okay. <sighs> so 
so there's a is that yeah he, he focuses on the lever and we get back here if we if we move away so is that the only thing he focuses on what does it do ah stops the conveyor belt oh Oh no, it starts moving in the other direction. And that's... Is that a toggle? Yeah, that's a toggle, okay. Wait, she's focusing on the belt as well. Ooh, that's... That's not safe. <laughs> yeah, we can't get. Ooh, are we stuck in here? Oh, we can walk up. Oh, that's oh, that was the sea level. Okay, yeah. Oh well, yeah, it looked like that. Ooh, okay. Interesting steps. Anything else in here? Oh, look, he automatically turns. You run in that direction and he just does an about face. <laughs> That's cute. Okay, so it's definitely not there. Oh. Uh, well. Ooh, I... That's left and right. Now that's the crane he mentioned, right? Mm -hmm. So left and right moves the crane along its path. Can we... Oh yeah! Is that a scoop? What is it? Yeah, it is. Okay. So... Mm -hmm. I can lower it into the water. Okay, so nothing over here. What about the other end? Those don't look safe. What even are... Ah, they're the coral grinders or something? Wait, where did I lower the... The game is not gonna let us go there, is it? They must bring the core over here to be crushed. Yeah, okay. Either that or these are the biggest, meanest looking hair curlers I've ever seen. <laughs> hair curlers. Those things are dangerous. I'd be ground to bits. Yeah. Calcium powder. <laughs> Those things are dangerous. I'd be ground to bits. What's the oh that okay you can get down here. Uh. Jure, hey, how are you doing? Ooh, nice beach. Hmm. Briefly popping in. I appreciate it. I appreciate you popping by. I hope you're having a good Sunday.
Hmm. Okay, so we lowered this thing here. Can we do anything? Because we lowered it here? I'm gonna assume we have we can because that's <laughs> how the game works. It's not a handheld device. No, definitely not. It's attached to a big crane. Okay, let's try the traditional approach. I don't want to mess up my blade. And by that I mean everything on everything. <laughs> okay, so we only got the side and the bust or is it gonna do anything? See why they don't give these chisels to the new guys. I think we broke the crane. Can we still do it? The scoops learned its lesson. Ah, so it is a scoop. I was wondering about. It's actual, yeah, it scoops up stuff. It's a scoop. It's learned its lesson. All right. Well, I'm not sure at, at what point this is going to become useful, but this was probably a necessary step <laughs> for something. Anything else around here? I just noticed that that water animation in the background is it's, it's cute, it's really nice mm. I don't think there's anything uh, there's anything else to do here at least not right now Can we still operate the crane? Is it broken? All together? Oh no, no, works. But no, no scoop. Can we still... Okay, we can still operate the chain even though the scoop is not attached to it. Still lower it on the beach. Oh, whoa, wait, 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 what happened? <laughs> uh, okay, that did a thing. We're being all kinds of destructive tonight. over here does it do the same thing with the scoop it just lowered it into the water a bit why does I'm gonna save I'm gonna say that it's changed position for a reason. The fact that it's only a chain now is obviously useful in some way. Um, uh, what if we... 
How do I get how oh, how do I get off the, the crane? It's it's specifically lowering the chain instead of lowering it into the water as it did with the scoop. It's lowering it onto the conveyor belt. So let's leave it onto the conveyor belt. And let's try to get off the crane if I can. Okay. Now Alright, I was gonna try to walk down here. I didn't know that just walking next to the... Up to the belt would bring us down there. Okay, right. So what if we... we I'm... Really hesitant about doing stuff with the belt, but... Hey, how do I get off? The crane arm broke as well. That's why the chain is falling closer to the main. Oh right, the, the right. Yeah, of course it broke off. Yeah, okay. So the lever reverses the conveyor belt. What if I reverse it now with the chain up there? Is it gonna drag the chain along? Yeah. Great. You can hear you can hear the chain effect still. Okay, let's save again. This is I'm sorry, I know I know it's probably annoying to see me save like this, but can I still get on the belt then? Because we didn't just do this for looks. I just saved so let's try I think that maybe the other part leads to somewhere else goes in two directions so it makes sense can we even go that way Yeah. No. Hmm. Let's try it again. Uh -oh. Oh. Nice ominous music, but I seem to be floating in mid air. In mid water. <laughs> I'm sorry. Um, okay. Where is that? Is that an anchor? That's an anchor, yeah. So where does this go? Okay, so we drop the chain so we can get... No. No, wait, that's not the same chain, is it? This chain is holding up this boat. And that's glorious. <laughs> See? I knew he was fine. Hey, buddy! Gladys! You're okay? Of course he's okay. Well, it hurt a little when I hit, but my head cracked open an aft panel here. I gotta tell you, <laughs> I thought you were dead. Oh, Manny, I've been having a great time. Listen! He's been enjoying himself. 
He, he's fixing up the engine of an old boat. Is there an engine that can resist the love that's in these hands? Apparently not. Apparently not. I think this baby's our ticket out of here. Oh yeah, good point. I was just wrenching it for fun, but your idea is good too. Oh, that that boat? I, I don't know. It doesn't look very mobile. <laughs> think this baby's our ticket out of here oh yeah in fact it kind of looks a bit precarious fun, but your idea is good too that that's where I'm getting anxious looking at the weights sitting in the water and we're just walking all over it okay so what do we do now <laughs> that's great I think this baby's our ticket out of here Oh yeah, good point. No, oh, nothing to do. For fun, but hmm. The the end dialogue button comes in handy sometimes. It does. Okay, so we got to Glottis. Man he wants to use the boat to escape. Somehow. Okay, so climbing up just leads us here hmm. I'm gonna get off at this point I'm not sure I have a good idea about how to progress with this. Anything to do with this guy over here. Maybe we can get something for him to bust out Meche? If we give him back the busto? No way, I don't want to remind him that I do. Ah, okay. Ah, sweet Mary. Ah, sweet Mary. We don't have anything else, though. Chapito! Ah! Quick yelling! Nah. Well, you don't want that big old bro. So Manny definitely wants to keep the bus tall. Which tells me I'm gonna need it again. Do you want to use the bus Not doll? Right now. Um. Not right now. Not right now. Wait. Why? Why not? Not right now. Not right now. I'm trying to open up the inventory. Not right now. So definitely, <laughs> the game is telling me don't use anything on anything here. <sighs> okay. Let's not do it then. Wait, can I... Oh, can I use the bus tow on... On the door? It's me, Meche! Yeah, I know. I'm sorry I didn't trust you! I don't want to mess up the wheel. The wheel's my friend. Hey! I don't want to mess up the wheel. The wheel's my friend. Okay, what about the I handle? I running out if of If I air. bust all the handle, then I'm never going to get in there. Is there anybody out there? Is he focusing on... Oh, that's the, the, the lock. Yeah. Help! Oh. I promise I won't pull guns on anyone anymore! Must have hit a major circuit. Manny, where are you? Hmm, but it looks like I've exposed the guts here. Okay. 
So what do we do? I can't move those by hand. I need this wheel. Ah, the wheel. Okay. I think it's that time. I think it's it's puzzle time. Okay, so let's see how this works. Uh, moving down just moves us away. I can't move those by hand. I need this wheel. Moving up doesn't do anything. Moving left and right does something. So those are obviously the, what do you call them, the, uh, the tumblers, yeah? Those are the tumblers. To me, like moving them in one direction just does this, moving them in oh, yeah, moving them in the other just does the same thing but in reverse. Oh, wait, when you start. When you start reversing, they move one at a time. Aha. Okay, so... That's cool. Uh, <laughs> what do I do with it? <laughs> It's an analog device. I'm not gonna be able to to just cheese this. I'm not gonna be able to just wait. So so those are the tumblers and some of some combination, some position of these four tumblers is gonna allow me to unlock the door. That's what that's how this type of lock works. I'm gonna assume. I guess I didn't enter the right combination. Oh yeah, and it does a really interesting animation there. I guess I didn't enter the right combination. They go crazy. Hmm. Now, what I'm wondering is, do I need other information? Or am I just not seeing what to do? Because it could very well be that that this is all we need to unlock the door. That this puzzle is all we need. Wait, wait. Why is the why is only one of them moving now? What's going on? Wait, I hadn't engaged with them. Yeah, let's reset them again. I guess I didn't enter the right combination. Yeah, look, when you reset them and you move left, only the lower tumbler works. When you move right, the lower one starts moving up, and then they go in turns. Uh, 
And when you... Ah, oh, look. When you move left. And then you start moving right. What if I arrange them to be as uniform? Like this, more or less. No, let go, Manny. Try the lock. Try the, the handle. I guess I didn't enter the right combination. No. What about the other way around? Because they are flat on one end, aren't they? When the flat bit's pointing this way. Uh, that's more or less what it tried, wasn't it? I guess I didn't enter the right combination. Okay, let's try it the I other way. By hand. I need this wheel. Yeah, like this. I guess I didn't enter the right combination. Hmm. Maybe we need something else. Has the game given you any clues for this one? I know the solution, but I don't recall if you get hints. Well, the only... Uh, no, I don't think we have any clues. Manny makes a comment about not having the union card because we used the union card uh no not the union card but we used the something in the in the first bit to 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 in year one what did we use what was that item with, with the vacuum pipe i think he makes an allusion to this to use the card in, in a similar way to stick it in there i think to, to unlock the tumblers and that's all, all we have about this. Don't tell me the solution. <laughs> but just arranging them a certain way. It's it's going to be one of two things. It's I'm either going to need to arrange them a certain way. Which, which I'm, I've tried two combinations so far I'd say. And this could take forever because there's four of them and the flat bits pointing one way and each of them pointing another way could be a combination. Or I'm gonna need something else in order to engage the lock in some way. That's that's what I think is going is going on essentially. Wait, I, I'm still not sure how that works. Oh. So if you move, yeah, if you move left a bit and then you move right, it takes, it goes from up to down. You can move them individually. No, that's that's the thing. I guess I didn't enter the right combination. I'm not sure if I should stick to it or go looking for something else. But we don't really have much else to do around. I guess doing it again wouldn't hurt. Those tumblers must be made of a harder steel than the outer door. 
Yeah, okay, so I get, can't get through the tumblers. Okay, what about... What about the side? Ooh, I hate that sound. Oof. Wait, but he did try doing something, though. sound can't see really is he oh I hate that sound is he trying to to place the side between the the door frame and the tumblers wait let me take a look up close again I can't move those by hand I need this wheel. yeah yeah What if, what if we make room for the side to fit in there? It'd be like using, yeah, it'd be like using something flat, like maybe the card comment. So let's try to get the flat bits uh, facing that way so that... <laughs> So how did this work again? You move, yeah. Okay, and yeah, moving it left sort of picks up. And you move them one by one like this. Is that gonna be enough? I don't wanna mess up my blade. <sighs> Come on, Manny. Nah. Ooh, I hate that sound. Hmm. Ooh, I hate that sound. Let's try it again. Let's put this away. Yeah, they're not really aligned really well. Oh, that's, that's better. I don't want to mess up my blade. Hmm. Oh, I hate that sound. Nothing. Maybe just a tad flatter? Or is it maybe the other way? Let's try it. let's try it again. Like this. Now individually. Uh, that's not... It's really fiddly the way the one moves when you move them to the left. Yeah, that's what I want. And now just a bit to the left. Uh, I'm gonna say that's good. I like to keep it next to where that, that that bottom one really isn't I can't move those by hand I need this wheel yeah I like this I want them all lined up so that I can put the side in there it's scraping right now I overshot it a bit. I 
I, I need an analog stick to do this better. <laughs> Okay, okay, right, so that's, that's how, okay, so now we engage, because the tumbler is in a specific position right now, yeah, there you go, first try, <laughs> oh, I only spent about right, 10 Michi. minutes on this, you can come out now, Michi? wait, she was in there, wasn't she, oh, Oh, Manny's not animating. Oh, I think we got us a bit of a glitch. Wait, I read about this. I actually remember this happening to me once. Usually if you, if you try to engage animations once or twice, that should fix it. I do have a save nearby, so that's not really a problem. He's just floating about, which makes it a bit gruesome and and frightening. Yeah, there you go. Okay, right. All right. Let me save. I do remember uh, years ago when I first played Year One, bits of Year One. This happened once, and I read about this somewhere. So where is she? <laughs> she was in here. Okay, he's focusing on the tumblers. Uh oh, oh Raul, I am so so sorry. We closed the door from the inside. That's not fair, game. That's just not... Well, I, I did save right before I did it, so that's not really a problem, but come on! Focusing, looking at the tumblers doesn't mean you close the door. <laughs> what is he looking at? That X? Can we do something with the X? So where's Meche? Where did you go? Oh! Look at him go! Look! Interesting center of gravity. Look, I can barely, <laughs> I can barely pull it, but I can swing it around. It's a cosa is heavy. <laughs> That's really cute. Okay. Anything else? Those are are those file cabinets? They're all locked up. These must be very, very sensitive coral harvest reports. They're all locked up. Looks like years and years of coral harvest reports. This can't be what this secret safe is meant to hold. Where did she go? I always love that suit of armor there uh, there is in, in the there? corner. It's time to come out, honey. No time for hide and seek. Yeah, it looks really interesting. I, honestly, I didn't think she would have been in there, but it's time to come out, honey. No time for hide and seek. I guess it's worth a try. No, she's not in. Man, people in the old days were huge. <laughs> That's a bit meta. <laughs> They're all locked up. These must be very, very sensitive coral harvest reports. Mm, no. Oh wait, Electrical what? Electrical current makes my marrow tingle. I don't think it's gonna be as easy to pick from this side. I already 
did that from the other side. I don't want to bust all that. <laughs> what about the side? I don't want to mess up my blade. I don't want to mess up my blade. Mm. Manny, I knew you would. Why is that door closed? Uh, it was the only way I, uh, uh the wind. Oh. Uh. Okay. What? <laughs> All right. Well, using the side is proving to be quite efficient. You can see why they live in the inventory because you end up wondering what to do and you have the side and you just use it on stuff i didn't even i don't even know what i used it on <laughs> i just used it on something and it opened the door let me see hey this is my room Go okay room. that's where she was okay Thanks for not shooting me. Look, I'm sorry. I should have trusted you. It's just that the past two years have been pretty tough, you know? Mm hmm. You look like you could use a nice ocean cruise. Still my travel agent, eh? You look like you could use a nice ocean cruise. Nothing else? Still my travel agent, eh? Anything else around the room? Cases? Suitcases, luggage, and something else up there. Okay, what about the cases? What's in these cases? Take a look. Mm. It's all the double end tickets Hector and Dom have stolen over the years. Oh dear! Each oh right. Okay. Soul. Yeah. And now they just sit there. That's it. What? They just sit there. That's what's been bothering me. In the days when I was a hot salesman, mm -hmm. I used to see double in tickets all the time. And they move. What do you mean they move? They become agitated around human souls. And the ticket that belongs to you will actually fly into your hand. But these tickets, and the tickets in that suitcase of Charlie's, it's like they're dead. Why would Hector and Domino be hoarding cases of counterfeit double in tickets? Ah, oh, they're counterfeit. Oh, okay, yeah. Um, of course they're counterfeit. Why would Hector and Domino be hoarding cases of counterfeit double end tickets? They're not real tickets. Okay, the plot thickens. Uh, what's this there? I couldn't reach that vent, even if I stood on Mitch's shoulders. Wouldn't it make more sense for me to stand on your shoulders anyway? Are you kidding? Look at your heels. <laughs> Yug. <laughs> Okay, so I, I'm gonna do it again. I'm uh, I'm gonna assume that using the side on whatever that is is gonna have some effect. I couldn't even reach it with that. Oh, well. Ah, okay. Now all we have to do is wait for the room to fill up, and we'll just float on out of here. Well. This is disappointing. <laughs> me, we don't float, remember? Yeah, they don't float, Manny. We've been walking around the, the ocean floor for a while now, so... Uh, and now we're all damp. Anything to add, Mercedes? Vent is the only way out of here that I can see. Nothing else. Is that what we engaged? Some sort of circuitry? Mm, no. That like closed the door, yeah. My marrow tingle. Okay. Oh wait, there's a... 
there's a valve in here. Great. Oh, at least we're not getting... That water on us anymore. Is the same thing gonna happen if I try again? Yeah, but the water is shut now, so it doesn't. Can I turn on the water again? Ooh, maybe it's more will come out now. Oh, not again. <laughs> the music cues are really nice. Nicely done. So, I'm gonna say no. That's not gonna be a way to get out of here. I can turn the water on and off. Wait, where's the water going? It's draining pretty quickly. Aren't we... Well, we're not underwater, but still. Where, where is it going? Oh, not again. I don't see any... It's just disappearing between the tiles? Yeah, that must be it. Not again. Mm hmm. Going away between the tires, yeah. Huh. And a bit towards the center, isn't it? Over this black tile? Oh, not again. Maybe there's a secret compartment or something that the water is draining into. Oh, not the black tile, the one next to it, uh, this one. So... Uh, <laughs> well, man is not acknowledging it in any way, so... Maybe it's just the way the animation is done. Nothing, nothing else but this. So this sprinkler, those are sprinklers, yeah. Yeah, I, that's the same procedure. Okay, so that's. I think that's all in this room. Uh, what about uh, anything about the suit of armor? That was uh, the extra is probably part of the, the suit. Yeah. That thing is definitely not my size. Man, people in the old no. that thing is definitely not my size. Maybe Doesn't we can bust it open. Like it would be a shame, but Doesn't still. Look like he'd enjoy a piggyback ride. I think that would just bring the whole ugly thing crashing down on me. Probably, yeah. Would have been fun to see, though. The side? Want a piece of calavera suit? Yeah. <laughs> this is really cute. Hmm. Okay, so the only thing, the only thing that's left, that's interactive, is the. That thing, the X. What if I swing and bust through the door or something? Now yeah, that's that's not gonna work. Uh, 
How far can I drag this? Can I take it with me? In the other room? Oh yeah! There we go. Let's try to... Let's bust open the pipe. Yeah, let's do that. If I can even get to the pipe. No. No. Doesn't let me get to the pipe. Oof. It's still amusing to see that, but... I don't think I'm getting it. <laughs> no, just really close to it, but not far enough. That's as far as he'll go, yeah, that's, that's it. I can go back, but not forward. Oh, wait, can I... No, no, no. Let's no, he, he turns, makes a turn. Yeah, so that's not gonna be it. I, I don't know. So carrying that thing around means I have to do something with it. So what do I do with it? What about the cases? Can I get close to the cases? No. It can't just be an, an object that sits in there. To... After you. What about the suitcases? What happened? Forget them. They're counterfeit. They wouldn't fit through this hole anyway. Let's go. Ah, that's where the water was draining. Okay, so it was you know, that tile. I'll meet you back here with the boat. What boat? Well, I'm working on that. Okay, Manny. I have to figure a way to launch that ship Gladys found. What I need is a giant stork to deliver that big baby right here. A giant stork? Wait, is he seriously trying to... To suggest that we're gonna use that ship, that's... Okay, so we... Let me save. Can we talk to her still? I really just dropped that thing on the tile and it broke. Um, and that was the uh, that was obviously the way to get out of there. I'm not. I'm not sure even that counts as using the the axe. Just randomly dropping it on a tile. <laughs> I could definitely see myself still being stuck there if I hadn't dropped it on that tile. The water draining was the clue to see that there was something beneath the town. Yeah, so the animation was suggestive of the water going there. Yeah, I was probably eventually going to to, to try that. Yeah, I guess it makes sense. Okay, okay. All right, I'm not gonna argue. We're there. <laughs> Wait, I wanted to try to speak to Meiji. I swear I'll get us a boat. Okay, Manny. I swear I'll get us a boat. All right. Okay, Manny. 
so we should oh, we should go back to the ship um, down the conveyor belt, right? How did ah oh, okay go around the fence? Yeah. Wait, isn't the chain... Hmm, that's a bit fudgy. I can see why there's a bug in there. I don't think... Yeah, that breaks the sequence, doesn't it? The chain is supposed to be down there, and I just... Yeah, that's... Mm. Okay, I'm gonna do it again. Whoa, 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 whoa. No, wait. Oh, for, for a second there I thought I couldn't just get, get down there. Maybe that was the bug. Okay, let me try this. I'm gonna save. I wanna see what happens if I reverse the conveyor belt with the chain on it. This is gonna put, yeah, it pulls it back up. It bunched up a bit, bunched up. No. Uh, why did no one inform me that I was gaming? I don't know. Twitch's fault. Hey, yonder. <laughs> uh, the chain bunched up around the anchor, and that anchor is stuck to the other ship. So. The stork suggests the, the stork illusion suggests that I want to use the crane to actually literally pull up that ship. Um, okay, it's not the the most amazing thing, the craziest thing that's happened in here. I just got on the crane and... Okay, right. Galatis, I'm so glad you... <laughs> we got a boat! Is the boat already? Yeah, come on! Let's go eat some reef! Ooh, it's that kind of boat. No, he's, st he's still listening to music. What? <laughs> so, are you really going to bring me back and try to get your old job again? There's no job for me now, except to bring you and everyone else here to the end of the road. But if you aren't going to use me to get your job back, why did you spend all this time trying to find me? Meche? I... I needed to find you. Oh, that's sweet. Yeah, I code it. <laughs> that's a good code, Brad, with a knife, yeah. Yeah, I see what he did there? Because he's our boss. Okay. So he's... Uh, that's the... Uh, the, uh, the sub with the octopus in it. That's the octopus eye, which is incredibly creepy. Hey, pull over, octopus. 
You're going too fast. <laughs> Do we fight? Boss fight? <laughs> okay. Oh yeah. Uh. This doesn't look good for the kids. Look, Tom, I'm not gonna work for you. Oh, don't worry about that. You're fired. Just consider this. Oh, we're fired. Great. Ooh. What are you doing away from your desk anyway? I'm saying you fired us. Back to the phone pile. Hmm. Smart strategy. Always let your boss win. You fired us. But you're really just a pawn. Please save the comic book one-liners for when you're winning. Just like with your selling, Manny, you got a weak attack and no follow through. Hmm. I want to see how many lines he has because I don't think we're doing anything right now. Just please stay down this time. Okay. Oh, that was different. Yeah, yeah. Oh no, the first one was like that. Party you passed out before you really got hurt. The Christmas party. Yeah, they keep alluding to that Christmas party. Had enough? Hmm. <laughs> Showing off for the girl. <laughs> no more lines. Ooh. Yeah, we're not doing anything. Okay, so if I get close, he attacks. If I don't, he just sits there, so... If I don't have the scythe, is he gonna still attack me? No, he doesn't even... Okay, well, that's good. And man, he only focuses on the octopus hey, eye. Octopus. You're going too fast. So, let's do the trick. Let's try the side, which I'm assuming is the only thing we have right now. Is it? Yeah, okay, so we only have the side. Let's try it on the octopus side. Uh, there you go. Yeah. I don't believe you, Calavera. You're losing a fight, so you pick on one of my pets. Why aren't you more like me, Manny? He's monologuing. Angelitos! Oh, so they, they were good kids. It did. One year later. Okay, oh, that's year three. Wait, that's, that's all? That's all in year three? Huh. That's cute.
Do I have control? No. Name. Oh. Roxy Poligiano, sir. Hmm. Waiting room number two. Next. Glorious, you okay, bud? Nope. Glorious. Glorious. It has me. He's fine. I'm sure he's fine. This time. Okay, let me save. So this is this is year four. Okay. <laughs>